Here's my favorite gambit, it's the angling gambit. It starts out with d4, e5, and then they accept the gambit by capturing the pawn, and then you bring your knight out to c6 to attack the pawn, knight to f3 to defend the pawn, and now queen to e7, attacking the pawn. And now they usually play bishop to f4, defending the pawn, and now queen to b4, checking the king, attacking the bishop, and attacking the b2 pawn. And when they play the best move, which is bishop back to d2, you just take the pawn here, attacking the rook, and now here's where they might fall into a trap. If they play bishop to c3, attacking your queen, defended by the knight here they think they're protecting their rook but now you play bishop to b4 pinning the bishop to the king and now it's basically a lost game for white the worst possible move they can do here is breaking the pin with the queen here and now you just take the bishop they take back and here's checkmate but they might take the bishop here and realize what's going on and then you take with the knight and now the rook is still under attack so they need to bring the knight out so the queen can defend the rook knight to d2 knight captures c2 the king has nowhere to go queen has to capture the knight here and then you take back with the queen and you're up 